36 plus year old company known for TIG welding quality. We have all these great fabricators that see a robot in the building. So immediately the wall is up. What is this machine? Da 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 da. But we ran apart. Any TIG welder or any welder worth his salt would look at this and he might have a problem with you telling him that's a MIG weld. He wouldn't believe it. But uh, with the Cobot, with their weave settings and their back and forth settings, you can get it to look like anything. The first parts we wanted to automate was obviously some of our high volume parts, and that's going to be a circular weld. A big concern was full penetration. These are $100 million yachts. A leak could literally put the crew in danger. You could sink the ship. We have found no leaks on the weld by the Cobot yet. That's the beauty of what Hyrobotics has done is they made the interface with the UR robot so easy. If you want to weld a circle, press circle, click three points. It knows that it needs to weld a circle along those three points. You want to do a line, two points. It's that easy. Troubleshooting on the Cobot is amazing. There's a support feature in the app where you can click and get somebody on the line within seconds. The best part about it is I can take pictures and send the pictures and say, hey, is this the right setting? No, Justin, change it like this and do that. And in seconds, you just eliminated being down for days, if not weeks. There's, there's a lot of features in the app. Everything is a number, graphs and charts that'll tell you everything. How long the arc was on, how much gas, how much wire you used. Anywhere your cell phone is, you have access to that robot in real time. I have my certain doubt, but I was wrong. To be honest, that's an awesome machine. The program is not hard. I'm the one to teach employer. I don't have any robotic experience. They pick it up so fast. And the robot now, the name is my baby. We're saving a lot of time on a lot of parts, um, especially me welding. Most of the time when I would get the part that the robot welds, I'd have to try to maneuver it around and be able to weld it in, in a tricky position. And now it's already welded up and it makes it a lot easier. The welds by the robot look uh, beautiful. As we've embarked on this mission, there's been several aha moments. Great welders get caught up doing the day-to-day, -day, same repetitive stuff. and Morale drops, you, you're creating drones. And now that they see the cobot, you could see their brains explode in their head and it's like that same welder that was over there in his little welding cell kept his head down never talked now he's calling me on the weekends hey justin i got a new idea why don't we run these parts on the cobot you can see the intrinsic passion and the motivation it's there it's as far as a culture or morale booster i mean it's, it's everywhere <laughs>